Another dovetail is a sliding dovetail. As its name, they slide into each other. It's slightly tapered, therefore when you put it together and you hammer it together, it is a beautiful, very strong joint. A good example of that is my water pond. If you look at that, it has six shoulders, so if, even if it's a little sloppy, the water swells the spine and would not leak. Why the bottom doesn't leak? I use a old, old timer's joint, so-called boat builder's joint. When my grandpa showed me that, he said, shh, that's a family secret. Nobody knows how to do that. Well, grandpa, I saw this joint for hundreds of people. I'm very excited to show it to you. It's simply, you plane the bottom of that pond all the way to the bottom, you plane it nice and flush. Once you did that, I uh, use a tool, gallon, gallon paint cans handle. You bent it, you have two of it. You clip it in half and bent it, you have two of it. Put this on the middle of your wood and hammer it. And keep moving. Create a nice straight line all the way. Do the same thing across. Put it on the middle and start hammering it and moving it. So you do this all the way around on the bottom of that water pond. Next, you plane it off. Then you nail on the bottom. Nice big headed corded nails, you nail on the bottom. So what happens once the water hits that, as soon as the water hits that, watch it, watch it, it's keep it's swelling up. You see it on the end very well. You created the man's very first gasket. So each time water hits that, it's pushing against the bottom. Therefore, my water pond doesn't leak. This is an old one. If I would put water in it right now, it perhaps would leak for an hour or so. But then it swells up and my gasket will hold the water. There goes the family secret, Grandpa. Sorry. <laughs>